So how goes it? And well, we've got another unboxing, but we got two different unboxings this time. The first one we have is the Aladdin blind box. And this is not Will Smith Aladdin. This is uh, Robin Williams, the genie Aladdin, the better one. So um, then we have a Lost Kittens um, to unbox. There's like 31 to collect in this. Includes Lost Kitten figure, figure two accessories, shaping compound, meme sticker, and collector sheet comes in this. So something interesting about this, huh? All right, so what, we're going to open up Aladdin ladies first. Which one are you hoping to get? Um, I don't know. They're all good. I like the Aladdin. I don't want to hit the was too. Oh, you don't want the market seller and... Yeah. Which was played by Robin Williams, you know that, right? He played that voice. A little close. A little close. Not that close. <laughs> Too close. Egyptian Tupperman. Still fresh. <laughs> what do you think you got? The genie. Do you really think you got the genie? I do. Oh, yeah, you got the genie. I can tell just by the little tip on that. <laughs> That's the genie. So we got what we wanted with Robin Williams, the genie. was primary, the main one. Look at that. Look at that. Robin Williams, the genie. Will Smith, you'll never be this good, just so you know. You know, you're always going to be the second best genie in the Aladdin series. Maybe. Because there was that other guy who played the genie who did a pretty good part that everybody thought was Robin Williams, but it wasn't. And your CGI ugly mug isn't going to match up to what this guy ever did. So you should quit now. It's kind of like what you did with your son with Karate Kid. You wasted everybody's time and money. All right, lost kitties. Lost kitty time! Who's hiding inside, huh? So it opens up like a real milk cart. Whoa, look at this. This is neat. So when you open it up. Now I can get. To... Oh, it's a box. Comes in a cube. This is weird. There's like compound in here. I guess that's. That's what the... this said. Compound. Shaping compound and meme sticker. Okay, so let's see here. This is the collector's booklet. He, is he, he must be in there. He's got to be in there. But where's my sticker? Maybe he's in there too. Meme stickers in here, huh? Okay, so let's let's see what we're getting ourselves into here. It's like a Play-Doh-ish kind of, almost like sand, moon sand, I'm guessing. It feels like... Play like putty, like a play. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can. Nope. This one's different. This is way different. It's like. <laughs> it's like a task to go in there. Now I see why the whole first one sold out because somebody probably discovered how cool these were and then went and bought a bunch of them. Oh, there it goes. I hear it moving. Almost feels like that. Shake, 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 Sonora. Do the bonga line. I got the shake, 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 Sonora. Oh, there you go. Oh, this must be your cat. Oh, it's a cat. Ah, uh, here it is. So everything is in this little break because here's the. Oh, this is yours. And the accessories are in it. So it's, I guess, like some kind of like. Call it shaping compound. Feels like Play-Doh almost. It really, it smells like, it's Play-Doh. It's like a non-colored Play-Doh. Yeah, so make, make a turkey or a hmm. chicken. Chicken. All right, so. Hand me the knife that's right there, see it? Black handle, right there, yeah. It almost blends in with your pen, all your paint brushes. It does smell like play. Oh, so it's exact. So the meme sticker matches what you get. Pixie purrs. Pixie purrs, huh? That's who that is. And you get some Play-Doh, which will dry out shortly. Because I'm playing with it. You're looking for it in my hand. All right. Well, you can play with the Play-Doh all you want. And we will see you tomorrow.